Welcome to the ODI. Uh, I'm Larry Elliott. I'm the economics editor of The Guardian, um, and I'm chairing today's event. Very much looking forward to it. Uh, just a couple of pieces of housekeeping, if I can, at the start. If anybody's got a mobile phone, can they perhaps put it onto silent or vibrate so that it doesn't disturb uh, our speakers? Uh, and uh, at the end, I hope we're going to have plenty of time for uh, questions. Um, and uh, when that happens, perhaps you could uh, say who you are and, and who you represent, if anybody, and keep your questions nice and short. That will prevent me from having to be all fascistic and cut you off, which I'm quite happy to do if you ramble on for too long. Uh, what, what, why we're here today is to launch Government Spending Watch, which is a joint initiative from Oxfam and the Development and, D and Development Finance International. Purpose is to shine a light on what governments are spending on achieving the MDGs, the, the uh, deadline for which is rapidly approaching, 32 months, I think, away. Uh, so the idea is to find out exactly what is being spent in every uh, developing country as far as possible. Um, some uh, data is not universally available, but the idea is to find out exactly what is being spent, which countries are achieving, which countries are not achieving, what needs to be done uh, over the intervening uh, two and, and a bit years. So uh, I think this is a really, really interesting uh, initiative, and you can get a full copy of the um, Government Spending Watch online. I looked at it this morning. It's a very, very uh, good document. Um, I know there are, there are uh, many people watching this online, so um, please feel free to contribute your <coughs> uh, questions uh, and comments, and we'll try and take some of those in the Q&A at the end. Now, um, we've got quite a big panel, so I'm going to ask them to, 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 to get a bit of a move on. I'm going to uh, say who they are. Uh, on my far right uh, is, uh, is Liz Stewart. She's Director of Policy and Research at Save the Children UK. Uh, uh, on her left is Marcus Manuel, Director of Budget Strengthening Initiative at the ODI. On my immediate right is Matthew Martin, who's the Director of Development Finance International. On my left is Phil Bloomer, who's the Director of Campaigns and Policy at Oxfam. And on my far left is uh, Nuria Molina, who's the Director of Policy, Advocacy and Campaigns at ActionAid UK. Uh, coming uh, over the airwaves uh, from South <coughs> Africa is Hello, Toko. It's Toko Madonko, who's the organiser of the People's Health Movement in South Africa. So her presentation is going to be beamed onto the screen, and she's going to talk to it uh, when she, we get round to her in about 20 minutes' time. But I'm going to ask Matthew to kick off and explain to us in more detail what this initiative is all about, what the purpose is, and what it hopes to achieve. I'll start with you. And if, if all panellists can, when they, it's their turn, grab the mic, because otherwise... Um, it won't be able to be beamed uh, over the net. 